Now, we've asked to factor a poly, uh, trinomial here, and our coefficient on the x squared term is not 1. Then what we have to do is use a different strategy. And first thing we're going to do is look at the constant, which is the tw plus 12, and the 6, which is the coefficient for the x squared. And we're going to look now for two numbers that have a product of 72, which is 6 times 12. We are also looking for two numbers that have a sum of 17. And so now if we go through, and we're going to ignore uh, 1 and 72, because 1 plus 72 is 73, and that's too high. We're also going to ignore 2 and 36, because 2 plus 36 is 38, and that's too high. So we'll look at 3 times uh, 3 times 24 is 72, and when you add them together, you get 27, so that is too high. Next, we're going to look at 4 times 18, and which is 72, and when you add those together, you get 22, so again, we're too high. Uh, next, we're going to use 6, because 5 does not, uh, we're not going to use 5, because 5 does not divide evenly into 72. And so 6 times 12 is 18, and that's just a little bit too high. 7 does not, is not a factor of 72, so we'll move on, and we'll look at 8. And 8 times 9 is 72, and 8 plus 9 is 17. So our two numbers are 8 and 9. And what we're going to do now is write this, the 17, as a sum of the two numbers that we found. So all we're doing is writing this as 8 plus 9 times x, which is the same as 17x. And so now what we're going to do is distribute the x through the, through the bracket. So we're going to write this as 6x squared plus 8x, because 8 times x is 8x, and 9 times x is 9x plus 12. Now we're going to put brackets around the first two terms in the in this expression and the last two terms. And what we're going to do now is look for the greatest common factor in each bracket. And so for the first bracket, the greatest common factor is 2x. So we're going to factor 2x out. And 2x times 3x plus 4. So all we've done here is... 2x times 3x is 6x squared, and 2x times 4 is 8x. So all we've done is factored out the 2x, the greatest common factor. We're going to do the same thing with the second term, or the second bracket. And the greatest common factor here is 3. So we're going to factor out the 3. So 3 times 3x plus 4 is the same thing as 9x plus 12. And you can check again by distributing the... Um, distributing the 3. So now what we're going to do is factor by grouping. And you'll notice that we have 3x plus 4 in both, um, in both terms. So here, we're going to factor out the 3x plus 4. And in the first term, we're going to bring down the 2x because that's um, what's going to be left after we factor out the 3x plus 4. And what's going to be left in the second term when we factor out the 3x plus 4 is the plus 3. So now what we have is the answer to our question. So when we factor 6x squared plus 17x plus 12, we end up with 2x plus 3 times 3x plus 4. And if you multiply this out using FOIL, you'll get that answer, the 6x squared plus 17x plus 12.